If I had one minute with Rishi Sunak, I'd asked him to do just one shift with me, one long day. I'd say uh, you don't understand at all. You've got no idea, um, and you need to you need to spend some time with those those nurses um, working with dying children, um, elderly people who, um, if they don't receive your help, will die. In 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 their own homes on their own. They need, he needs to see people that are suffering and um, the anguish of people who are trying to help them and can't. We need the support from the government to actually safe staff these wards. It's too much to handle now. It's grim. It's very, very grim because there's not enough of us, particularly the experienced ones are all living. And this is affecting our daily nursing care. You leave at the end of your shift. You are demoralised, you're exhausted, you're tired, you're upset, and then you know you've got to come back and do it again. You know that you're not delivering the care in the day that you, you want to or should do. Um, so it's a constant feeling of failure. Not being able to dedicate time to be with families and with patients at their last moments is probably the most soul-destroying part of our job. You're dropping us into, I say, a battlefield and we really need to be trained on how to deal with it. Because I can say for one, I wasn't. Unless something changes now, the NHS will be gone. If I had one minute with Rishi Sunak, I would ask him, do you care? Do you really care about the NHS? Will you keep it the way that the NHS was always intended to be? Prove it to us.